Welcome back to Mystery Mondays, the Monday Mystery Show for another episode of Shardlight. We're here at this guy's house. Uh, I guess we're going to do a B&E. Uh, Amy would just kill this guy, so I guess we're going to have to use our word bullets out of our face gun. I still had the I still had the regular the crossbow bullets. Okay, never mind. We can't talk to this guy. We can't use any sort of bullets. Whether from a crossbow, a gun, or a mouth. We can't use any of those. Too flimsy to support my weight. Anyway, I don't need to go upstairs. Upstairs could get us downstairs, A B. There's a window right here. <laughs> that would be Okay. Do we need to make a grappling gun? They're creeping up. Those vines are yeah, we could take... Okay, whatever. We could take them, tie them into a rope, put them in a crossbow boat, shoot it through the window. That would be very... That would be very smart. It would be... Oh, just peeking. Good evening, Mr. Harrison. What seems to be the trouble? You know damn well what the trouble is. I've got that blasted plague. Hmm. What symptoms have you been having? Last week, the coughing started. Since then, it's only gotten worse. Which one are you here to see? The the doctor or the old man? Can't remember. Silas Harrison. <laughs> That's his name. He said Mr. Harrison, so that must be the old guy we're here for. Have you been in contact recently with anyone showing symptoms of the disease? Well, two weeks ago I was relaxing outside in my yard when some vagrant came by to ask if I could spare any food. How dare they! I couldn't, but he became belligerent when he heard that and spat in my face. To think, a man of my stature with Green Lung. I can't imagine the scandal. Green Lung doesn't discriminate, Mr. Harrison. It can affect anyone. So can you do anything for me, Doctor? Nah, you're too old. You're gonna die anyway. Who cares? The support of the Ministry of Knowledge means you'll receive only the finest care <laughs> the government can offer. I'm going to give you a dose of vaccine. That should fix you up by morning. But you <laughs> still not what vaccine does. That's not what that's not what the word vaccine means. <laughs> still, it's still not what vaccines are prophylactic. You don't give vaccine to somebody who <laughs> you don't get you you treat people. Or you treat, you treat people, you give people a treatment. I don't know what a technical word would be, but it's not vaccine. Because a vaccine is something you give to somebody who's not sick. So that they don't get sick. You don't give a vaccine to somebody who's sick. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. <laughs> you won't have to worry about entering the terminal phase. Let's not think about that. Your dreadful business, really. Let's focus on my treatment. Of course. Just hold still a moment. There we go. You should feel like a new man in just a few hours. I Just bring it to the Ministry of Medicine when you're due for your next That doctor definitely saw me. It's Yeah. The green lung vaccine is a valuable commodity, Mr. Harrison. We don't release it to just anyone. So can't you just come back and shoot me up? It's, it's, that, we know that's a lie. We've learned that's a lie. According to Danton, at least, that's a lie. But I'll leave the card here just in case. Oh, and I'll leave a little something with your butler to help you sleep. But give the vaccine a few minutes to circulate before you take it. You got the hard stuff, Mr. Doc? I'm gonna take those pills. <laughs> We'll wait for we'll wait for the butler to come in, then we'll come in and steal those pills. But how am I supposed to get it? I thought um, where is that confounded servant of mine? What was there was a purpose for us uh meeting Silas. Was it just the card? <laughs> was it just so we could get to the ministry? The window's not locked, but I can't Oh, he has to, we have to, we have to get that guard to stop playing with his topiaries. Okay. Oh. I've given him a dose of vaccine. He should be back to normal by tomorrow. Oh, joy. I'm so relieved. If it's any help, I have some sleeping pills for him. Oh, they're just sleeping pills? <laughs> That's not fun. <laughs> I thought it was going to be an opiate of some kind. Damn bell for everything again. Well, I wish He's already been reading it. He's been reading it this whole time. Nice evening. You too.
Oh, why did I go back around? Okay. We can't walk past this tree. There's a wall here. An invisible wall. And if you try to walk behind the tree, you'll go... Around the edge. <laughs> okay. Uh, distractions, topiaries. Nice looking bird. I don't think drawing it. Let's kill him and wear his skin. <laughs> then we can just go in the room. Rattling the bush. Okay. Let's look in the window again. Can't interact with anything in here. Can we shoot the window? Oh, we're out of bolts. Why didn't you say that earlier? You've just been saying, I don't want to shoot him. I don't want to. <laughs> anything in the bucket? Do we have to go somewhere else first? Can we, can, are we allowed to leave? We are allowed to, no. Okay, good. We're not allowed to leave. <laughs> I absolutely did not want to be able to leave, so it's good. I can't do much. I can't do much. Walk over there, Amy. <laughs> I don't think I'll be able to just walk right into the manor. I'll need to be a little more subtle. Uh, put a bucket on your head. I can't interact with her. <laughs> I don't see how. I don't see how. I don't think. I don't. I don't think. I don't. I don't. How many more objects are there here? There's manor, front doors, windows, around mansion, topiary, servant, topiary, manor. <laughs> and then over here there's vines which are useless <laughs> I don't my tr it's out I haven't gotten any I wanted you hey whatever oh we can see in the kitchen too huh it's up all right we can go in the kitchen perfect you just have to trigger oop we have to trigger the nice flag. That can stay right where it is. I'm not the maid. Free flower. <laughs> Just take the free flower. Take it home with you. Well, nobody else okay. I'm not a baker. Learn to bake. It's the apocalypse. <laughs> you got a free bag of food there. I haven't got time to go rifling through kitchen. Okay, then what are we in the kitchen for? I can't see any reason to look. Yeah, always with your reasons. I don't think I'll be... Ugh, there are... I'm sure no... Okay, what what she will and won't take. <laughs> I won't take any of the tools from my house. I'll take this guy's ladle, though. <laughs> I've got a whole rack of tools at my house. I can't think of any reason why I would want to carry any of those with me. This ladle from this guy's house? Definitely gonna need that. Definitely gonna be needing that. No type. Mm -hmm. To me? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I was never. <laughs> Let's have a whole bucket of it. <laughs> uh, what are we missing? What are we missing here? Salt. We already tried all that stuff, right? I don't think I'll be. That's enough for now. I'm sure they'll notice. No, she she did eat some turkey. I wasn't paying that much attention. I was clicking and everything, I guess. Okay. Let's eat all of it. Rich. I just can't get enough. Of my compliment. One more. It's all gone. Oops. <laughs> I don't see. Well, I emptied all the soup. <laughs> Let's leave. Let's go out the window. Maybe something will happen. Nope, nothing happened. Walk around here. 
Nope, still nothing happened. Let's hit him with the ladle. Damn it. I don't see how. I don't. I don't. I'm just trying everything on everything, Amy. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what you want from me. <laughs> Stop saying you don't. See. I don't. See. Okay, this was the kitchen. All three of these windows is the kitchen. Both of these is the bedroom. There's nothing in here we can touch. I don't see him. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, Amy. I don't... I don't... Okay, there's nothing else here. Again. <laughs> Again, there's nothing else here. Can we use the ladles of the vine? I don't know, Amy. I'm just trying everything because there's no clue. <laughs> there's no idea. What am I fucking supposed to do? I took a ladle. Why? Why did I take the ladle and eat all the soup? What was the point of that? <laughs> now there's no soup here. We stole this old man's soup. <laughs> it's all gone. <laughs> Did that accomplish anything? Or was that just for fun? <laughs> That's the only thing I've been able to do here. Put the ladle back. <clears throat> I don't need a wooden spoon. Ladle on the other hand. Definitely something I needed. Okay. <laughs> yeah, sure. Let's open this window. <laughs> And then go out this window. Maybe that'll do something. <laughs> Did that do something? Hey, check it out. This window's here. <laughs> I don't. Oh, now we can hear the bell. Is that it? Now the bell's hearable. So that's what the ladle's for. The ladle wasn't for eating all the soup. <laughs> that was just something I did for fun. So it, begins. <laughs> it has begun a long time ago. If you if you're gonna be if you're gonna be using if you're gonna be using the front <laughs> if you're gonna be using the front like that, you need a louder bell. <laughs> you rang for me, sir. I want my pills. What on earth took you so long? I was... Never mind the excuses. Just give me one. The old man didn't notice that the bell just went off on its own, even though we could definitely hear it from here. We heard it from here earlier. That's fine. Then if you'll excuse me, I'll return shortly. God damn it. <laughs> so you won't take pills unless they're crushed up into some tea, right? <laughs> you have crush them up. Okay, good. <laughs> I thought we were gonna have to solve more puzzles. <laughs> so now I'm stealing an old man's only means of getting more vaccine. Yes. I really hope there's something in the ministry worth finding, man. He's an old man. It doesn't matter. Look at him. He's already dead. <laughs> you can't take his pills, too. <laughs> Waking him up would... He may be a crotchety old... That's a fairly big bet. Anything else in here? Urn. Some dead person over here. <laughs> Let's turn off the light. Damn it. Let's sit in the... <laughs> Why would Harrison have a... Oh, no. No. She's going to start coughing. Just jump out the window. What? Who's there? It's me, your wife. <laughs> yep. Uh huh. That's sure. It sure is. They told me you were dead. I am dead. I'm a ghost. <clears throat> Take care of me. I'm sick. I knew you would. Ophelia, are you there, my love? <sighs> Not gonna say anything at all. Just gonna, just gonna let that go. <laughs> it wasn't even an issue. None of that was an issue. Uh, man, you need a you need to work on your fight or flight. You you're st you're stuck in the freeze. You got to get your fight or your flight. <laughs> you can't be one of those freeze people, Amy. Next time that happens, you need to be jumping out a window. And next time, next week is when I'll see you for whatever we're doing next. We go we're going to the Ministry of, of Medicine. See you then. There then. Next week. <laughs>